So in this problem, what we're going to be doing is showing the explicit steps in order to convert from meters per second into kilometers per hour. And so one meters per second is going to be equal to 3.6 kilometers per hour. And so in order to do this, is you need to know the conversions first. So you need to know how many meters are in a kilometer and how many seconds are in an hour. So we know that there are 1,000 meters for every one kilometer. That's a conversion you have to know. And then we're also going to convert from seconds to hours, but there's two conversions here. There's going to be one conversion, which is seconds to minutes, and then minutes to hours. So we know that there's 60 seconds for every single one minute, and then there's going to be 60 minutes for every one hour. So these are the three conversions we're going to use in order to convert. So now let's show uh, the steps to do it. So what you want to do is just write your initial conversion, which is one, and then it's going to be meters over seconds. So you want to write it like this, one meter uh, per second. And so now what we're going to do is target each, each uh, unit. So let's just go ahead and start with seconds first. So what we want to do is convert from seconds into minutes and then minutes into hours. So how do we go from seconds to minutes? So we know that there's one set, or sorry, there's 60 seconds for every one minute. And so what that's going to do is it'll cancel out the seconds and now we have it in minutes. So it's going to be meters per minute, but we want it in kilometers per hour. So now we're going to convert from minutes into hours. So we know that there's 60 minutes for every one hour. So now the minutes cancel and now we have it in meters per hour. So now the bottom is done, right? We have it in hours, which is what we want, but what we want it is uh, kilometers now. So we are going from meters into kilometers. So since it's on top, we write it on the bottom, so it'll cancel. And we know that there's a thousand meters for every one kilometer. So that'll cancel out the meters now. And now we have it in kilometers per hour, which is what we wanted. And now we just want to multiply it out and you'll see that it comes to the value. So it's going to be equal to 3.6 kilometers per hour. So, right, this makes sense. 1 times 60 is 60, times 60 is 3,600, divided by 1,000 is just going to be 3.6. So these are the steps that you use to convert, but yeah, so that's just showing you the steps. So yeah, I guess this whole thing's going to be your answer, but yeah, hopefully you found this useful.